I think a lot of developers sometime, uh, today are, are weighing their options in terms of monetizing environmental attributes. And it primarily comes down to, do I monetize my projects through the carbon markets or do I do this, this REC instrument? The tricky part with carbon markets is that there's a lot of upfront investment that's required. It's not um, unexpected to see a, a co upfront cost of twenty-five or thirty thousand dollars. So the transaction costs on the REC side are significantly lower. So we say that when it comes to um, lar uh, large renewable projects, and by large, basically anything above a kilowatt or two, um, the, the it makes sense to go the REC route. Um, for very small projects. Um, the mechanisms that are used to convert from electricity to carbon potential are favorable for very small projects. So if you have a 200 watt solar panel, um, going the route of what, what, what Solstrom offers is, is probably more appealing because the carbon equivalent is, is much higher for the, for, that, for the initial allotment of electricity. But as you start getting into a kilowatt, two kilowatts and beyond that, um, the, the value of the REC becomes much higher. 